All right, I'm recording. First of all, thank you to Ultimate Portal Master in the Discord for letting me know that this exists because I did not know. Although I guess this uh, this was just today that this was announced. Little Nightmares Three. Now, when I first saw this, um, well, my first uh, instinct was to was to think that it was fake, um, and that it was a uh, not real announcement, but it seems to be very real, so that's cool. Um, and then I was like, obviously I'm really looking forward to this, but at the same time I'm a little bit worried because um, after Little Nightmares 2, the developer of Little Nightmares, Tarzir Studios, said that they're not making any more Little Nightmares games. Uh, which means that Bandai Namco, who owns the series, if they want another game made needs to give it to a different studio. So presumably this is by a different studio. Which is a little concerning, because I don't know, you know, obviously a big part of... <laughs> it was Tarzir that did a good job with the first two games, and so it being in someone else's hands now is a little bit worrying. I don't know who the studio is or anything, but perhaps we'll find out today. Um, so yeah, let's uh, let's look at it. Well, first, let's go to this tweet. Little Nightmares 3. Welcome back to nowhere, little ones. Oh, they screwed up the hashtag, kind of. Little Nightmares 3 is scary, so bring a friend. Sequel introduces co-op survival. Survival? What does that mean? What do you mean survival? Okay, that's... that's okay. <laughs> um, let's go to the... Where... Where was this announced? Xbox Wire. Okay, so it's not a PlayStation exclusive. That's good. It's on Xbox. First look at new location. What? What? Okay, we'll look at all the... Okay. <laughs> there's a lot going on. All right, so this there's a link here to a website. I pulled up the website. This is a PlayStation blog. Little Nightmares 3 introduces co-op to the franchise. A lot of people saw Little Nightmares 2 and assumed it was co-op, but lol, nope, it actually wasn't. Um, but this one is going to be, face your childhood fears together with a friend. Okay, let's look at this image first of all. Whoa. This setting, so it's a carnival, which is great, love that. Love that for a Little Nightmares setting. Um, got like a mirror here with smoke. Smoke and mirrors. Could the lady be involved, perhaps? I don't know. She did stuff with smoke and mirrors. That. How much do we want to analyze this image? All right, let's look at our dudes here. Look at our main characters. Huh. There's a key there. Dead bird. All right. Oh man. A particular uh, a particular greeting to those who survived the Maw and the Pale City. Brace yourselves, for you might not be so lucky at our next destination. It's with great pleasure that we now prepare you to return to our charming world of darkest dreams, known as. The Nowhere. Welcome to Little Nightmares 3. Is The Nowhere the name for the whole world of Little Nightmares? Not just the setting of Little Nightmares 3? That's what this sounds like. Return to our charming world known as The Nowhere. Interesting. Darkest Dreams. In Little Nightmares 3, we expect no less than what we have always expected from you children. Courage, cleverness, and imagination. If you think you've come well equipped... Please proceed at your own risk. And there's a trailer. There's a trailer. Let's watch it. Little Nightmares 3 announcement trailer. Did this just get announced on the blog? Or, or was this like a... Was there a state of play or something? I don't know. I have no idea. Oh, Gamescom is happening now. That that must be it's probably Gamescom because game because Little Nightmares one I think and two were both announced at Gamescom. That must be it. Anyway. Okay. 
Bandai Namco. Bandai Namco, yeah. Uh huh. Supermassive? Supermassive game. Isn't Supermassive games like the Until Dawn developer? Is that right? Oh, okay. Ooh. Oh, got a fuse. Classic. Oh, d can you travel through mirrors in this? Oh. Whoa! That's so cool. Love that. Looks like it, yeah. What is all that? Oh my god, I can't believe... It like weirdly just hit me that this is actually happening. Like seeing this trailer all of a sudden makes it feel so real. 2024, okay. Holy shit. PlayStation. Super Met. Hold on a second. Let me let me make sure. Am I crazy? Hold on a second. What the hell is that going on there? Whoops. Okay, don't worry about that. <laughs> um, super massive games. Yeah, the it's it's the Until Dawn. Um, Dark Pictures developer. They're making Little Nightmares 3? Oh, I guess they... They've worked on Little Nightmares before. They ported Little Nightmares 2 to Stadia. And updated... They made the enhanced version? They ported it to the next gen, I guess? Okay. Previous titles. Okay. Killzone HD. Okay, well that's... That's interesting. Um, okay. Sure. I don't really know what to make of that, because I, I mean, I'm not super into Supermassive's other games. Just not my style of game, I guess, but... Obviously this is very different from that. Um... And it's not like their games aren't well made. Um, so I, I guess I don't have much to be concerned about. It's just surprising. For the first time in the Little Nightmares franchise, you can face these new horrors with a friend using online co-op. If you'd rather embark on the shooting by yourself, you'll also be able to play solo with an AI companion. This worries me a little bit. I mean, cool that there's co-op. That's great. Um... Uh, I feel like I'm hoping that this I'm hoping that the solo experience is still good and it doesn't feel like it's supposed to be you know I hope that the solo experience is still fun because I feel like sometimes when like oh it's meant to be co-op but you can play it alone with an AI it ends up feeling like eh, if you're not playing it co-op you're not getting the real experience I don't know hopefully that's not the case here you'll play as low and alone Okay. Two lost children seeking a way out of this gloomy world and trying to escape a greater threat lurking in the shadows. Look at that. What's that? What the? F okay. <laughs> Computer enhance. Oh, I see. They're just lowering a platform for the other to jump on. Low and Alone are each equipped with their own iconic items that will allow you to solve various puzzles and defend yourself against the new and dangerous challenges that await you. You'll be able to interact with the world using Lowe's bow and arrows and Alone's wrench. I wonder if you're playing solo, do you get to pick who you play as? But you also need your wits, tenacity, and creativity to survive your trip across the spiral. 
The Spiral, you say? Okay. The game's first chapter takes place in the desert sands and ruins of the Necropolis, a city of eternal energy and certain death powered by gusting winds. Cool. The ancient metropolis is now more of a ghost town. It's unclear what happened to its inhabitants, but perhaps a giant baby had something to do with it. Okay. The necropolis is home is the home of Monster Baby, a new resident with swiveling doll-like eyes who is, due to her bulk, an agent of sheer destructive force. She may not seem cruel and malevolent at first sight, but her size, clumsiness, and curiosity might become dangerous for our dear visitors. Cool. Low and alone will have to find a way to navigate these ruins while staying out of her way, and Monster Baby is far from the only danger they'll face. So, are you ready to dive deeper into the twisted world of Little Nightmares 3? Yes. The game will be released on PS5 and PS4 in 2024. I'm assuming, because this is on the PlayStation blog, that's the only reason they're only mentioning PlayStation. Not going to be a PlayStation exclusive. Um, we saw Xbox tweeting about it, so. Okay. Let's watch that trailer again. Because I want to. Where'd the trailer go? Oh, right, it was here. So in co-op, are like, are we together from the beginning? Because in Little Nightmares 2, you don't start off with Six as your companion. And there are parts of the game where she's taken away from you. Um, and that is why, like, it wouldn't really work as co-op. The game isn't designed for co-op. Even though it looks like it should be co-op. Is that going to be the case here? Like, are, is, are we together the whole time? I wonder how this lore is going to connect to the lore of the other two. Like, a bunch of people disappeared. Little Nightmares 2, clearly. There's clothes all over the place. Um, seems to be a similar thing happening here. I wonder if the lady is involved. See, that's interesting. So is that just an ability we have? A little umbrella? It's cool, sure, why not? Puzzles. Love some puzzles. Mm. Oh, there's all those bugs. Away from the light. I can't believe this is actually happening. I'm I'm pretty excited. You know what's funny? I I feel, it feels like Little Nightmares Two like wasn't that long ago. It was over two years ago. That was like two and a half years ago at this point. Um, it was when I started streaming. It was the first game I streamed. What is this? What are all these? Are they shoes? Because that's been a thing. Piles of shoes in previous games. I don't know. Eh, it doesn't look like it. Interesting design for the protagonist. They, they're, they're quirky looking. Cool. LittleNightmares.com Let's head over there, shall we? Well, this just takes us to the Bandai Namco site. Little Nightmares 3, you follow the journey of Low and Alone as they search for a path that could lead them out of the nowhere. Interesting. Trapped within the spiral, a cluster of disturbing places, the two friends will have to work together to survive in a dangerous world full of delusions and escape the grasp of an even greater threat looking at the shadows. For the first time, it's co-op. Great. Awesome. Mm-hmm. 
Brand new world. A cluster of dystopian lands. Interesting. Ooh. Discover places as diverse as the mysterious desert of Necropolis, an unsettling fun fair, a gloomy factory, and who knows what else. Run away from a new cast of foes, ranging from ominous beetles to a giant baby, and so many more. Cool. Get the latest Little Nightmares 3 right in your email box. Apps are fucking lootly. Don't have to ask me twice. Okay. Um. What else? What else? I mean, it, I, I'm excited. Gotta wait at least four months. I don't know when this is coming out. Maybe it'll be early in the year like Little Nightmares 2 was. Who knows? Um, yeah, I'm super stoked. I mean, obviously, you can see by my avatar, I really like Little Nightmares. <laughs> and I'm excited to see it continue. Yes, I'm a little cautious because it's not Tarzir Studios, but everything I've seen so far looks pretty cool, so I'm I'm going to try to be optimistic. All right. Goodbye.